for all the answers? It will work, Rex. We just need to finish building the Crucible. Although I'd be interested to learn how you found out about it. Wasn't that hard. Lucky you keep its location more secret than the fact it exists. And I'm sure you'll do a good job of both, being so famous for your discretion. Welcome back, Chief. Commander. You're saying they survived into this cycle? Yes. We called them Collectors. They fought for the Reapers. For a long time, no one knew they were Prothean. And when did you realize? Shepard had no choice but to kill the ones she encountered. They were all indoctrinated, and had been for a long time. I'm sorry. I am grateful. It was an act of mercy. Yes. I suppose it was. Did I mention Salarians used to lick their eyes? How far they have come. The Morden Salarian asked if he could dissect me. I approved, but only if he could defeat me in combat first. His reply was problematic. Then he left. I do not understand that one. This Cerberus. I do not understand why your own kind would oppose you. They will bleed the same as everyone if the Reapers are not stopped. The Rex Krogan offered me a job. He said whenever I tired of the easy life of luxury on the Normandy, he would give me something real to shoot at. Yes? Lola? You see that Krogan female? Huh? 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 Up close and personal. I think the male's got the pretty gene. You had a hard time leaving Earth. You still want to head back? Hell yeah. But I get it now. It's not where I'd be most useful. Not yet, anyway. We'll get back there. I know. And I'll do whatever it takes to get us there, Commander. Maybe no more shuttle crashes. No promises now that I've gotten the taste for it. Besides, I like to keep Esteban on his toes. I take it you and Lieutenant Cortez know each other? Yeah, Esteban did a stint on Fell Prime where me and my squad were stationed. I caught up with him on Earth a few months back. He's a good guy. Just don't tell him I said so. It'd go to his head. You got family back on Earth? Yeah, an uncle. Retired military. Got a few cousins I haven't heard from in a while. You and your uncle close? Yeah. He was the reason I joined the Marines. It was about the only good thing in my life after my mom died. No dad? He's there. Somewhere. But I'm not sure I'd call him family. Not anymore. I would like to find out how my uncle's doing, though. You mentioned a mission you had against the Collectors. What happened? Pretty much what I said. Things went foobar, and I was one of the few to make it out. If you want the rest of the story, you're gonna have to get me really drunk, or... Or what? That's about it. Sorry, Commander. Just not interested in talking about that. Next topic? What's with you and the nicknames? It's just my way of remembering people. Some people just don't match their names, you know? So, I just give them a new one. So I'm a Lola, huh? Yeah, my best friend's sister growing up was Lola. Older sister. Hot. Tough. Right. I'll talk to you later. You bet. Everything okay with the shuttle? Just double checking the inertia dampener coils. It'd be twitchy in these UT-47s. But don't worry, this bird's been rock solid. I always see you down here working your ass off. Ever take any downtime? I get my sleep, Commander. Flying tired is nearly worse than flying drunk. What about your waking hours? Any R&R? &R? I need to keep myself busy. Otherwise, well... Too much time to think. I appreciate your dedication, but I don't want to see you burn out. 
I know my limits. I wouldn't take a chance with your life. So, before this war, you must have done something to relax. Sure. I remember back when the Hawking was based out of Arcturus, and I was just a fighter jock. There was this observation deck overlooking the main flight paths. You could watch every ship taxi in and out. When I was alone, I'd turn off the auditory emulators and just watch them drift by in silence. You know, there are views like that on the Citadel. Next time we're there, you should take some shore leave. Clear your head. I don't know. Maybe. Take some time off on the Citadel, Steve. As a favor to me. If you put it that way, how can I say no? You can't. Any updates, Commander? Our backup's waiting for us at the drop point. Arlac Company. Krogan Commandos. That's correct, Shepard. They are an accomplished unit. Their decisive action in liberating a colony from Batarian pirates made them famous. Good to hear. Other than that, there's been no word from a team of Krogan scouts since they went through the Rachni relay. Understandable. In my cycle, we use the Rachni as living weapons. Weapons? They were only animals then, without technology. Violent, but useful. When they became a problem, we burned 200 worlds to stop them. We don't know much, but no Rachni activity has been reported. Still, it's troubling there are rumors at all. It's been years since you released the last Ragnite Queen on the condition she disappeared forever. She was desperate to save her race. You're telling me you let a Ragnite Queen go? Are you kidding? No. It was the right call. Just be ready for anything. Yeah, shuttle just arrived. You better get moving, Team 2. See anything, let me know. Grunt? Shepard? <laughs> Shepard! <laughs> what are you doing here? I could ask you the same question. Didn't those idiots lock you up? They did. Put me in lockdown to keep the Batarians off me. Didn't want problems with the Council while they prepared for war. But the situation changed. Yeah, they got bigger problems, all right. That's why I'm out here running Arlac Company. They're tough. Think they're invincible. Reckless, but effective. Sounds familiar, Grunt. How'd you go from being new and unproven to your own command? <laughs> wasn't easy. When Rex put Arlac Company together, he needed a leader who represented the future of our species. Thanks to you, I completed my rite of passage on Tachanka and became part of Clan Erdnot. I was an equal. And being the strongest, I was chosen to lead this honored company. I bet some didn't like a tank bread Krogan being in charge. I collected a few scars earning my place here. These Krogan respect me. You were a pain in the ass, Grunt. But if your Krogan are half the soldier you are, we might make it out of here. Eh, <laughs> glad you're here to crack some heads, Shepard. Hard to believe this might be Rachni. Seems crazy. Rachni. A chance to face the old enemy? <laughs> Impossible to resist. Yes, you are the one. The Krogan who occupied my quarters on the Normandy. You left your mark. What? Who is this, Shepard? You shouldn't be so anxious to face the Rachni. They were formidable opponents, even to my people. Ask me later. <sighs> Whatever you say. We don't know if the Rachni had anything to do with this. We're here to find the scouts. I didn't see any signs of activity during our approach. Agreed. But this place smells wrong. Like a bad wound. Our scans show the tunnels down there lead to a large central point. If we're lucky, it's a nest. Rachni have nests? <laughs> our luck company! Move out! Grab what you need, Shepard. Meet me at the scout camp ahead. Sounds good. Take what you need and move out. Their base camp has been decimated. The Krogan are overconfident. 
It's their weakness. Ready, Shepard. We're right behind you. You ready to go? Tell me more about this company. Arlak means Eye of Wrath. We are named after the fierce Tichanka son. Rex handpicked us from different clans to show a united Krogan. We were sent because we're the strongest. What did you do after the Collectors were defeated? I spent most of my time back on Tachanka learning what it was to be Krogan. In the lab where I was created, the lessons were like fighting with practice weapons. They had no bite, no impact. I needed the blood and pain. I made mistakes, but I learned. What happened to the scouting party? Looks like something dropped half their camp down a hole. Their shuttle must have been lost as well. They weren't going anywhere. Doesn't matter. We're here to find the Rachni and burn them out. Did Warlord Okir imprint anything on you about the Rachni during your creation? Okir ensured I knew of the Rachni. They are respected as an enemy. Everyone thought they were dead. Defeated by the Krogan. You proved that wrong. If they're here, my blood demands they die. All right, let's get going. Finally, right behind you, Shepard. See it. Grunt, got a body of a scout here. Been dead a few days. Yeah, if he has his weapon, grab it. He won't need it anymore. Whoa. Is that webbing? Looks like it. Stay sharp, people. Agreed. Everybody be ready. Those Rachni are just not right. Grunt, Rachni presence confirmed. Modified and very dangerous. 
Finally, something to kill. Nothing here yet. Lost a Krogan to a sinkhole. Bad way to go. The breeding ground must be here. The Reapers are protecting an asset of great significance. Reapers have messed this place up. Agreed. Let's find out why. Tech? Very good. Our exit is cut off. Looks like we're finding another way out of here. Come on! What was that noise, Shepard? Sounded bad. Cave in. We're all right. Good. Didn't want to dig you out. Well, that hurts my feelings, Grunt. Yeah, yeah. Shepard, I know what happened to the scouts. What'd you find? They got hit hard. The leader ordered them to carry weapons deep into the caves. They died making sure we could make it to the central chamber. Come on. Like a last message. He's asked that it be delivered to an Asari named Araba on the Citadel. A large area, Commander. Casualties? It's fine. Krogan fight better angry. Who are those little bastards? The Arachnite is the dweller of toxic planets. This is different. These don't look like regular Arachnite. The Reapers must have changed them. 
You know what? I think they're bringing an army of those things down here. It all adds up. They reproduce crazy fast, and out here, nobody will know until it's too late. I agree. And they're throwing everything they've got at us so we don't reach the nest. Shepard. That wasn't webbing stopping us. That was Reaper Tech. We ran into it too. The Rachni have backed off for now, but they can smell our wounds. Any worthy enemy would regroup and finish us. Soon. We're close, Blunt. Those barriers were protecting whatever's down that passage. We'll dig in here, kill anything that moves. Buy you some time. Good luck. I don't need luck. I have ammo. Krogan, get ready! We've located the central chamber. Good. We got your back, Shepard. <sighs> Move it! Damn it! What switch? Keep it up, people! 
the job. Copy that. Reapers did this to you? Yes. The sour note of the machines is everywhere. I let you go back on Novaria. You promised not to interfere anymore. The Rachni were supposed to disappear. We remember. We kept our promise. Retreated back through the relay. We started a new home. Beautiful children. Harmony. But the machines came. They heard our song. Their shriek of sour notes drowned us out. They can't hurt you anymore. Yes, we understand. Can you still feel the Reapers? Can they influence you? We hear the machines, but they cannot control us. Remove this last shackle, and we are free. The children return. They will destroy us all. Really fast. We're getting movement here. A lot of movement. Copy that, Grud. Are you capable of fighting the Reapers? We hate the machines. We will fight for our unborn children. Really fast. She's a mess. She needs too much time to escape. Shepard, we're out of time. We stay here. Our lack company dies. Is that clear? Listen up. Arlac Company holds the Rachne off while the Queen escapes. We'll buy you some time. Grunt, fall back to our position and lead us out. Damn you, Shepard! I'm leaving my team. On my way! Commander? That's an order. She's too valuable an asset to lose. Shuttles down that path. I'll hold them off. Get out of here, Shepard!
Cortez were the last ones out. Copy that, Commander. Shuttle is waiting. Grunt! Anybody got something to eat? I'm reviewing a report on the Rachni situation, Commander. This could have gotten complicated fast. I hope you know what you're doing, cutting a deal with the Rachni Queen. We got burned last time. I'm trusting your instincts, Commander. We can count on her support, Admiral. I hope so. But we cut the Reaper supply of new Rachni troops and picked up some additional Krogan support. I call that a victory. I've got to get back to it, Commander. Watch yourself out there. Hack it out. Shepard, you made it out of there. Sounds like I missed a hell of a fight. It was bloody, Rex. We could have used you. Too busy talking rather than fighting. Feeling restless. A war going on and I'm stuck keeping the peace. I heard you made some kind of deal with the Rachni Queen. If they get out of hand again, it's your ass on the line. Understood. I heard Grunt managed to get out of there with a few scratches. You could say that. We'll get him patched up, back in the fight. Good to hear. I should get back to it. Keep me posted, Shepard. Shepard, test verified. Results promising. Can synthesize for universal Krogan immunity. Good. Then you can put your knife away. The cure's ready? No, still need transmission vector. Cure useless, unless given to entire species. You're usually full of ideas, Morden. You altered the genophage before. There must be a way. Of course, always possibilities. But time limited. Can't create new infection strain from scratch. Groundwater? No, too slow. Voluntary inoculation risky. Population too scattered for airborne, unless... Wait, yes! The Shroud. Constant global dispersion of air particles, built by Salarians to repair atmosphere of Tuchanka. Also used by Turian. We used it to secretly spread the genophage virus. It ended the Krogan rebellions. I'd be careful who you tell that to. Sometimes I understand why the Krogan want to shoot everyone in sight. Those were desperate times. Yes, yes, but useful now. Original genophage strain still in storage at Shroud facility. Can use it as transmission vector. Then you Shroud to blanket Tuchanka with cure. You clever little pie jack. That's our best shot, right there. Then finish your preparations and be ready to go, Morden. Of course. Ready when you need me. We'll be in med bay with Eve until then. Commander, Admiral Anderson is available on VidCom. Shepard. So I imagine by now you've wiped the galaxy clean of Reapers and we can all come up for air? Not quite. There have been a few complications. Aren't there always? Hackett filled me in on the crucible. Sounds like you've got some knots to untangle. I'm just glad I could take care of one of them for you. I got a you and Kaylee Sanders were close. I owe you for that one, Shepard. Kaylee and I met almost 20 years ago. We even had a run-in with Saren in his early days. She and I were... <clears throat> more than close. She misses you. I miss her. End of the world has a way of reminding you what you forgot to do. Maybe when the war's over, Kaylee and I will do something about that. You'll see her soon. I can hope. But you've got a bigger problem right now. Like a galaxy full of scared bureaucrats. It's what you hired me to do. Mostly you were hired to kill Reapers. I hope you haven't been sidetracked by all the politics. Nothing I can't handle. What about you? What's happening on Earth? I'll spare you the details, but let's just say a lot of cities around the world have stopped checking in. That bad? You and I knew what we were in for, but everyone else? I don't think the shock's worn off yet. Are you safe? That changes by the hour. I caught a shuttle evac out of Vancouver. 
And now we're running from foxhole to foxhole, just trying to stay alive. What about the Reapers? They're harvesting everything that moves. They're focusing on the big cities, which does give us some room to maneuver. You think you can hang on? Hell, we're still just trying to talk to each other. Right now, all we can do is organize the resistance at a local level. No lack of volunteers, at least. Everybody knows what's at stake. I don't know how we'll win this yet, but we will. Even if it kills me. Well, you've already died once, and that didn't slow you down. But let's not tempt fate. Keep yourself safe, Shepard. You too, sir. We'll talk again soon. Anderson out. Cerberus is attacking civilians on Benning. We've been asked to help evacuate the planet. You know, my lab studied the Ragni. Long distance communication with no time lag, the ability to control workers, and at close range, the Queen can even speak through dead or dying members of other species. Glad they're on our side. If we can develop instant long range communication without quantum entanglement, maybe when this war is over.